guys, I am back at the house today and we're going to be painting the living room finally. So I'm going to show you guys how it looks and how it turns out. Um, sorry if it sounds a little bit echoey, I'm in my filming room and it's like completely empty in here as you can see. So yeah, um, we have Luca and sherry Ann helping us paint for a little while and then we're going to be doing it ourselves. So that's what's happening. Let's go downstairs. Hello. I am vlogging. Hello. Good job. We're trying to cover these testers. Luca got it. Yeah. What? Luca, you keep ruining our house. <laughs> yeah. So this is what it looks like. It's like a really light grey colour, as you can see. This is the brand we're using. Yeah. And it's in shade Cornforth White. So it's not really a white, it's more wow. of a grey, but this is what it looks like. Are you going to paint this in a bit as well? No, that's way too risky. Oh, oh my shit. shit. Oh, that was very close. <laughs> so much swearing in this world. <laughs> Make sure he doesn't get too close to that other wall, right? You supervise him. Right, I'm going to supervise you. I don't need supervising. It's dangerous. Yeah, if he needs supervising. It's such a nice day today. Nice and sunny. Oh, sun's in my eyes so bad. But yeah, it is a really nice day. I don't think I showed you guys around the garden yet, but I'm gonna give you a little garden tour. So here we have some flowers. No, I'm kidding. Basically, we have like this weird sleeper thing with loads of plants, which we're probably gonna replant. Um, and then we have like this really cool decking at the back. And then we have like a shed, which I don't, I actually haven't been in the shed yet. So I don't really know what it looks like. This is the shed. That's cool. If we repaint it. What? They got it on the ceiling. Oh my god. Yeah, this is the shed. I think we could repaint it and have it into like a little studio maybe. I think that could look quite cool. But yeah. So that's... Alright, I can't close the door now. Help! Right. Is that how you close it? I'm going to hold it with my foot. There we go. Did it. Did you get on the Oh yeah, I didn't show you guys in the last vlog, but my mum bought us this kettle from Sainsbury's and it's so nice. It's copper. Amazing. I love everything copper. We also got these, which we've put here. I think I showed you that in the first vlog. These are from Danelm. And then we've also got some here for like coffee, sugar and tea. I don't really know what to do because they have only three rollers to actually paint with and I haven't got one so I don't know what to do. Like, I cleaned up the mould again today to try and get rid of it but like apart from that I haven't got anything to do. Like, there's just nothing else to do that I can do like right now because I haven't got another roller so I don't really know what to do with myself. Let me know what you guys would like to see in my vlogs because obviously I know I've just bought a house and I'm showing you all this like housey stuff in my vlogs. But if there's anything else you'd like to see me do in my vlogs, then please let me know in the comments below, just so it helps me out a little bit. Because obviously at the moment I'm talking about like all the things I get up to in my daily life, but if there's anything you guys would like to see me talk about, like any specific topics about maybe school or relationships, anything like that, um, then maybe I'll talk about them and maybe I'll be able to help you guys out. I've got this really annoying spot. I don't know what to do with it. Do you think? Yeah. Oh god, that's good. I'm just filming this moment. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get a fucking rug ah! out the window. Okay, it's almost there. Okay, you okay. go. Oh. oh my god. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we just threw it out the window. There's the whole rug. <laughs> What's the problem? Use three quarters for tin. What? Yeah. Shit. We have to make glass, haven't we? We're gonna have to buy four tins. Oh well. That's gonna be co that's gonna cost us like how much? 160 pounds. For paint! Oh my god. Why? Why did you choose this colour? You chose this brand, not me. So we just stripped the carpet and there's a hole in the floor. Oh my god. What are we gonna do? Oh. Ah! Put a pinch it on the sides. The sides. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, boxes. 
Stay. If you get electrocuted. This one is so, the wires aren't even that long. I really don't want you oh, to die. One. I pulled it out already. We're trying to see if this will fit on here because we like these ones better, but they're like really thin. And we don't know if it's going to cover this little bit here because we forgot to sand this down. Does it even fit? <laughs> you see? Oh, what the what? fuck is that? What is the... Oh, is that meant to be there? No. Looking at carpets. Should we have this one? <laughs> Just kidding, I hate red. So we're painting the second coat of the paint and it's looking pretty good. It looks quite even. It's really hurting my hands though. My hands are so red from holding the brush really tight. So we're trying to wire this little plug like switch thing and this red cable keeps popping out and Matt has tried to do it for so long and now I'm attempting to do it as well but I don't think it's gonna work the red wire keeps popping out so annoying I actually managed to get it in and then it popped out but I was pretty happy with myself that I could do it uh. <laughs> oh no <laughs> Back out again. What a <laughs> We finally wired the thing. Turn it on. Woohoo! Let there be light. Should we go IKEA today? No, I hate IKEA. Why? We can get loads of stuff. There's nothing in IKEA about I want to go to IKEA. You don't need to have I want to go IKEA. Why not go IKEA? Yes, Look at my shoes. Okay, so we have officially finished painting the walls at last. It only took us like seven days to do this. Um, so now all there is left to do is painting the doors and like the skirting and the door frames and all that because we got a little bit of paint on that, just a little bit. Um, so we started kind of painting the skirting here, which makes it all nice and white. And as you can see, this is what we haven't done it. Super excited about these chrome, like nickel, well, it's not chrome, it's like black nickel um, plugs because you get a USB port, like two of them here, so you can charge your phone without actually using a plug. So that's super awesome. So we're painting the skirting now. And we're already bored. We've done like hardly anything. And we have to do the whole room. Oh. <laughs> and we have to be so careful. We did every room in the house. I know. This is going to take so long. So my mum and dad have just come round. And we're going to be painting the tiles. Like this grey colour. Because they look like bathroom tiles at the moment. Yeah, we're painting them because we don't want to like change all the tiles because that will cost a lot. And because we're going to be changing the kitchen soon anyway, we thought there's no point. So just for meanwhile, we're going to be painting them so they look a little bit better. So these are the tiles before and this is the after. So this is what the kitchen looks like once it's all painted. It looks so much better. Okay, P.O. Box haul time. I have been sent so many goodies from like different brands so I thought I would do like a P.O. Box haul I guess. So I'm going to show you a few bits that I have received. I've received the Emporio Armani Diamonds perfume as well as the Giorgio Armani Sea perfume. Along with that also came loads and loads of bits from Giorgio Armani such as the Maestro Glow um, makeup like this is a foundation and then here I have the Luminous Silk Compact Powder. I also have the High Precision Retouch which this is a I'm pretty sure this is a little concealer stick which I'm so excited to try out. This is the highlighting and contouring face palette let's have a look at what it looks like inside wow that's so pretty so this is the Too Faced better than sex mascara um, the packaging is like a little bit crumpled because I've already looked through this then I also have the Kiko what is this highlighter in shade desert rose bronzer I believe this is so nice wow and I have another little box at the very bottom so that's a baked blush a mascara and a lipstick 
And then what have we got here? A Too Faced Primed and Poreless Skin Smoothing Primer Powder. I'm so excited to try this out. I absolutely love Too Faced products. Look how pretty that is. That is just so Instagrammable. And then I have some Nail Zinc Rayon Nail Polish. I have a few shades here. I'm really excited to try these out because I don't really know how these work. I've never tried them before. These are like contour concealer sticks, I believe. And then I have the amazing Disney Alice in Wonderland palette. Oh my goodness, I am just so excited for this. Let's get all of this out of the way. This needs its own space. Let's get this bad boy out. This is so difficult with one hand. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so excited. Are you guys ready for the magic? Da da. Wow, freaking love Alice in Wonderland. Oh my god, and it's got a butterfly. The butterfly moves, oh my god. Right, I'm gonna close that. Now time for the actual palette, which just comes out underneath here. Ooh, and it's got a little quote. I know who I was when I got up this morning, but I must have changed several times since then. Wow, that's so cool. Oh my gosh, look at the colors. That is just heaven, isn't it? Do you guys agree? I mean, these are very out of my comfort zone kind of shades, but I do really appreciate the colours, like, they are amazing. So pigmented as well, wow, look at that. And then I have a few lipsticks here as well, let me just get them all out. Oh my god, I actually love them. Do you guys see how amazing those colours are? Like, they have gone all out with the colours. I also received this cute little Kiehl's box, and it's got the two um, kind of like concentrate slash oils so it's got the daily reviving concentrate and it's also got the night recovery concentrate and since i received this i have used this one and it makes my skin feel so soft i really recommend for you guys to try it out i've also received some little goodies from rimmel because i just recently shot a contouring video with them so here's a little peek at what i got i am probably mostly excited about these cake nude lipsticks i am wearing this one here today and it's like the perfect nude and the last few little bits that i received are from barry m they really kindly sent me some nail polishes and some little bits and bobs which i'm super excited to try out and i think i'll actually be giving some of these away in my 1 million subscriber giveaway i'm about to film a video for you guys i'm going to be doing an eyebrow do's and don'ts so that is why i am in my usual setup and yeah i just thought i would say a quick goodbye so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did then definitely leave a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel so yeah that is all i hope you guys are having a wonderful day and i'll see you soon bye we are going to pick up the keys for our first house Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> step rivers when they're like so much room for activities and this is what i feel like it's off. <laughs>